You want to know how corrupt both sides are? Both Democrats and Republicans? <sighs> Republicans are going to have Trump as their primary. They don't even want him. They, they don't even want the guy. It's all because he has power and also because they went along with his big lies. So if they back out now, it's just going to look bad on them or it might get them into some legal problems. But then you also have the Democrats who think that they're safe running the same guy who barely won against uh, Trump, the criminal, who is running against him again. He barely won. <laughs> barely won last time, but, you know, let's burn him again, guys. <laughs> so stupid. But now with his stance on, on Israel and Gaza, he has no chance. Biden needs to just drop out. He, need, he needs to go away. Like, his chances were getting smaller and smaller. But now, with his, his stance on uh, Israel, no. He's done for. He is totally done for. There is no way he'll win the votes. He's, he's lost the young votes. He's lost the medium age votes, like, however you want to put it, like, the only ones that are going to stick with him are the, the, uh, the Trump cult-like, uh, fans that he has now somehow created by just running against Trump. So, he's... I don't know, he, he is not going to have anybody for him. We basically have two failures for our options that both sides don't even want. And it's all because the ones in charge decide for us instead of actually listening to the people. Instead of listening to what the people want, wait, wait. Instead of listening to our our votes, our voices, they'd rather <laughs> they'd rather just take money, and that's that's how it always goes with elections. It's all based on who who buys whatever. The votes don't matter. It's like it's like whose line is it is it anyway? All the points are there, but they don't fucking matter.